County Board of Supervisors voted to censure two of their own. Action News Now reporter Anna Torres is live at the chambers. Anna, what happens next? Well, I'm told the Board of Supervisors just wants to move on. Now, Supervisors Comenzi, Modi, and Rickard voted in favor to censure Supervisors Patrick Henry Jones and Les Baugh, but Supervisors Jones and, ba and Baugh voted against the censure. I will now call for the vote. Thank you, Chair. Supervisor Comenzi? Yes. Supervisor Modi? Yes. Supervisor Rickert? Yes. Supervisor Jones? Supervisor Baugh? No. Thank you. So the motion passes three to two, and my sincere hope is we can move on now and start addressing all the work that we have. And there were many public speakers who came to speak about this topic, either in person or over the phone. Some were in favor of the censure, some even calling for the grand jury to get involved, while others believed a censure wasn't necessary. I honestly believe that you need to follow through with the censure. It is a way to reprimand somebody who has not abided by the rules. It is simple. We raise our children to follow rules, and when they don't, there's consequences. And I am calling to um, object to Leonard Bodie and Mary Rickard uh, wanting to censure Les Blanc and Patrick Jones for opening the POS chambers to the public. Now, earlier in January, Supervisors Baugh and Jones reopened the board chambers after the board voted back in December to keep the chambers closed and keep holding board meetings online. Reporting live in Reading, Anna Torreya, Action News Now, coverage you can count on.